pretty good. You know, finally get a win. You know, and all the you know everybody was going crazy and stuff. So it was it was good to have like have two wins in the season, comparing how like the season went. Yeah, just just to kind of to have a chance to to go out and play good after that Texas A&M performance, to mm -hmm. come back and back that up defensively, mm -hmm. only giving up seven points. I mean, how big was that just from a confidence standpoint? I mean, it showed that we had you know something in us, and you know, it showed this weekend, this past weekend, and I mean, hats off to us, and that's it just shows that we have resilience. So, Court, going back to pre preseason in August and all that, a lot of guys talked about adjusting to Coach Van Gorders, not just his schemes, but his style, mm -hmm. you know, what he demands out of you guys. How is that relationship as defenders uh, evolved over the course of nine weeks during the season with your defense? I mean, he put a lot of responsibility on us, and we, we we're still learning, and we're we're just getting better, like every week and you know every day, and we're just gonna continue to do that. And Coach Van Gorder, is, he's he's you know a great leader, great coach for that, you know, and we're just gonna follow behind his footsteps. How did you respond particularly after the A and M game? I mean, it was it was hard. It was probably the worst performance ever. So you know, of course, it's gonna be hard. So you know, we he he kind of ripped us. After that game, but you know he he told us to keep on, like stick to the game plan. So, Corey, have you have you given much thought to your plans after this season? Uh, no, I don't know yet. So, how different has this year been for you, going from one of the guys on defense to a guy that, that now offense is focused on? And how, how different has it been for you? I mean, it's it it is what it is. You just got to keep playing and just keep fighting. So it's it's different, but I just got to keep working at it. What have you learned about yourself now having to face, you know, constant double teams, teams chipping on you doing those things? I just got to keep working and try to get better. That's all. You said that you don't know yet as far as after the season. Can you talk about what criteria or what things that you're going to weigh as you make that decision? I mean, my performance, basically. So it's all about performance. So if you just, it is self-explanatory. So I feel like if I don't do good, then, you know, if I do good, there's – you gonna send your stuff in to get evaluated? Not soon. Um, um, I, maybe I don't know. I don't. I, it's it's too. It's, it's we're still in the season, so I'm just trying to focus on the season. Just talk about the importance of being able to get at Aaron Murray and creating pressure on him. I mean, it's gonna be a big factor for for us to win the game. You know, getting pressure creates uh, turnovers, and the team with the most turnovers wins. You know, so. How much different is it for you having D on the other side, the guy that that? I mean, it's pretty big, you know. He he helps take out those, um, take off the double teams and chip blocks. So, you know, we just work off each other. You have a defensive coordinator, obviously. I don't know if you talked about this or not, but who has a lot of experience with Georgia mm -hmm. from the other side. Uh, mm -hmm. He's worked there before. You going in and knowing that, to kind of make things different as a player, you kind of want to represent him well. Um, definitely, you know, and it's a big SEC game, you know. Oldest um, rivalry in the South, you know, you always it's gonna always gonna be a tough game. So, Coach Van Gorder being um, a former Georgia coach, it's I mean it's gonna be it's gonna be something to, to watch. So. Does it, does it add a little motivation that you could knock them out of going to the championship game? Oh you yeah, win? you know, I mean, being realistic, we have nothing to lose, and to ruin their dreams to go into the BCS championship, that's gonna be you know that will make our season. So, anything else? Appreciate it. Thanks, Appreciate it.